Welcome back. Kenneth Che is a classical saxophonist. In 1996, his career got off to an impressive start with an award for the New York Artists International Competition, which led to his Carnegie Hall debut. Since then, he's performed as a soloist with orchestras around the world. He's currently a professor of saxophone at the University of Iowa. After a long break from Hong Kong, he's returned to the city of his birth for two concerts with the organization he founded in 2009, the Hong Kong International Saxophone Symposium. Casey, Kenneth, Hi. welcome to the works. Uh, thank you, Ben. Thanks for having us. <laughs> so um, we'll start, I'll start with you, Kenneth. Uh, so, you're here back in town as part of yes. the International Saxophone Symposium. Right. Uh, tell us a bit about this. You founded this symposium. What is right. it about and why did you start it in the first place? Well, I started because, you know, when I was in high school in Hong Kong, I was one of the very few saxophonist, classical saxophonists in training. And so um, I wanted to bring home, after my study in the States, I wanted to bring home uh, what I've learned for really the students in Hong Kong. So one of my closest friends, Winnie Chiu, who is the pretty much the manager of the whole thing, mm. and uh, she helped me to arrange uh, the event every couple of years to basically gather all the saxophonists in Hong Kong as, uh, as well as in China mm. or a other Asian countries. Uh, and then I'll have some of my friends from other countries to come and teach, teach nice. lessons and do concerts. So. And this time, 2023, the actual uh, symposium for this year, mm. what can we expect from it? Give us an overview, you know, will there be concerts? What, what's gonna happen? Right, well, because this is the, the really the first event after the COVID, pandemic so uh, we are doing a little bit lighter version of it we only have two uh, three concerts actually one was the outdoor concert a couple mm -hmm. of days ago and then uh, also we had the uh, saxophone ensemble concert with uh, you know several community saxophone ensembles as well as the the main group that we formed from all the talented uh, saxophonists and they're all studying abroad and doing doing concerts so I was a very very proud moment for me uh, because it's great to see so many so many students and you also have a solo concert yes. coming up as well and uh, our recital will be on the on the 19th right the can, can you tell me a bit about the recital sure. uh, I mean Casey you'll be yes, playing piano oh right? yes it's a it's a heavy concert a lot of music <laughs> a lot of big pieces and um, I think we have six pieces mm -hmm. and maybe a little surprise at the end yeah, yeah. as well so right. Yeah. We're trying to, uh, uh, actually, Winnie requested that I try to program some standard repertoire because mm -hmm. a lot of the local students are studying those pieces and also some newer compositions. That, right. that, mm -hmm. uh, the concert that, you, that, that happened, the, the one that right. just passed, uh, you right. had a world premiere and a Hong Kong premiere for a couple of pieces. Can you tell right. us about right. those? Those sound quite special. Uh, of course, the, you know, the, it's no stranger to the music scene here, Dr. Samuel Lowe. Uh, he composed a, uh, a piece for me for a solo alto saxophone and saxophone ensemble. It's a very interesting piece as based on a, a Chinese folk song, uh, Jasmine, uh, and uh, it's called The King of the City, the title. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's quite exciting. And there's a connection to Kowloon City, I heard. Yes, I, the, I kind of grew up around that area, so it was kind of him to put in a little bit something in the, in the <laughs> I also read that you like to champion new works as well so yes. not just classical works right. tell us a bit about that right I, I try to com commission um, living composer who uh, some of them are also saxophonists himself mm -hmm. themselves so they know how to write for the instruments so in the recital we will be performing uh, one or two one one piece is that one piece was written for us as a right. duo yes yeah. but I think five living composers what? Five living out of the six what? pieces five living composers right. um right. several of them actually quite young oh wow very uh -huh. new pieces a lot of new pieces Kenneth, I mean, you know, you've had a very sort of wide and varied and established uh, career uh, as a recording artist, a performing artist, and also as a professor. How do you sort of juggle or balance the time between these different things? Uh, well, it's quite challenging, obviously. Um, so we try to, whenever I can, you know, um, I try to schedule the performances when I have uh, like holidays, mm -hmm. uh, things like that. So, you know, I can, I can juggle the schedule. <laughs> you were one of the few classical saxophonists growing up here. Mm -hmm. How has the scene changed since then? I mean, now it must be very different. Oh yeah, I mean, as, as uh, people saw in the ensemble concert, we have just 
I don't know how many people, 50 or 60 mm -hmm. people just playing an ensemble is just incredible. And it's really heartwarming for me to see because that was the whole idea when I started the, the symposium to bring, to really start, you know, growing the saxophone uh, community in Hong Kong. So, wow. Uh, well, I mean, all this talk about saxophone, uh, let's, let's hear a couple pieces. I believe right. you've prepared uh, two pieces for us in the studio. Can you introduce them to us and what they are about? Yes. One of the, the slower lyrical pieces is by uh, a friend of ours, Andy Scott, also pretty well-known composer mm -hmm. and saxophonist himself. Uh, it's called And Everything Is Still. Yes. Um, and then the second piece excerpt of that would be the uh, Machinsky Sonata, Robert Machinsky, a, a Polish-American composer, okay. uh, which the piece is considered one of the standards mm -hmm. for right. classical saxophone. So. Okay, very exciting. Thank you, both of you, for coming well, in today. Thank you thank very you. much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. 